This is a short video to illustrate how I use Keynote to build graphics for Fuse. It's a nice drag and drop environment and what I've got here is that I've got a particular image that I would like to use in a banner. But it's a square image and I want to have it as a part of my banner. So clearly I'm going to have to manipulate things here. But what I've also got is the uh, template that allows me to check to see how big uh, the dimensions are. So I'm going to bring that template across. Again, you can see drag and drop. And this makes it easy then to change the size of this original art element. And you can see now that it's snapped to and given me all sorts of wonderful guides. Uh, it makes it very easy to create the correct dimension vertically. Now I'm going to align up horizontally, add a shape. Just give it a bit more of an outline here, snap it to there, and as I draw across, it's going to give me a whole lot of guides, but the one I'm after is that now. You can see that that's lined up perfectly. So I've got the outline of a nice banner forming. I also want to match as far as I can. I won't be able to do this perfectly. Some of the programs do this better, but I want to match the fill colour of this new, um, this new shape here with the fill colour here. So I'm just going to pick up just at the edge there. And that's not working for me. Don't you love it when things don't work? Let's try that again. There we go. So I've got a bit of strong sunlight on my screen, but as far as I'm concerned, that doesn't look too bad a match at this point in time. Now I need uh, some text, and I've already got some text on a previously created version of this. So uh, I'm just going to copy and paste that back in here. Drag that down. Again, you can see I get some nice guides. And there I have my banner. Uh, nice and quick and easy. You can uh, manipulate the text, as you would well know, uh, in other programs. I won't waste the time here in showing this. But finally, I'm going to use a screen snap to grab this and then turn that into a banner. And the best way to do this is to hold down the Command, Control and 4 keys on a Mac. I did, um, sorry, Command, Shift 4. Uh, I didn't uh, mention that I am working on a Mac, obviously, with this. And I just drag that across. And you can see the guide is, is giving me the size. And there we have 940 by 240, which is what's required let go and there's my screen snap ready for use in Fuse. All I need to do is rename that screen snap and uh, place that to upload it as I would no normally any other file.